So here I'm uh, going to test the single coil for AC voltage. I have two one eighth three quarter inch magnets stacked together here, and I brought it as close as I could to the coil. At one time, it actually knocked off the coil, which is not good because it would damage the insulation. So at a very fast spin you can get over 2 volts AC. This is probably about a hundred RPM. One, one thousand, yeah. This is 32 gauge wire. I use almost a whole roll of wire and the wires have, the coil has a resistance of 100 ohms, 2.4 volts. I'm not using a drill to drive the saw blade because in reality the wind is going to drive it and I don't have that kind of wind to make it to spin 500 RPM so that's pointless to use a drill except I guess you know the RPM So that's the bicycle axle and the soft 7 inch saw blade. But I think it will probably give me enough voltage. So there will be six coils in a stator and I'm planning to make two stators as I said before in my other video. So the two stator would, would be like this with this this in between. I'm not sure exactly what kind of wind turbine I'm gonna make. Now I'm just winding up the coils. I got these wires, wires really cheap. They're like $10 off eBay. I got 12 of them. That's why I thought of this project. They had some 27 gauge wires on sale and some 32. I was able to win the bid for the 32 but not the 27. That's why I'm using 27. If anyone is wondering why 32 gauge that's why.